To be honest, I was extremely happy and very excited. I was a bit shocked because I didn't expect it. You Why know. were you shocked? I think after two years of campaigning, I haven't really come across anyone that was even near coming out, um, whether retired or not. Um, so to find a footballer in Europe that's decided to, to come out, it's, it's kind of a big deal for me. Um, I think that you know, it shows that we are moving forward, not back, which is always great, and that my campaigning at least has served for some type of a purpose. And do you think this is going to encourage more sportsmen, particularly footballers, to come out? I think so. I think that they, they'll come to the realisation that being gay really isn't that much of an issue. Um, I guess you can be a sportsman and be gay and, and nothing really changes. I mean, why are footballers so nervous to speak about their sexuality? Footballers have a very big fear of, you know, being uh, classified as something or, you know, that's what you are. Because even in my documentary, I tried to get professional players just to speak about the issue, not to say you're gay, not to say that you have partners who are gay, just to speak about homophobia in football. And they were reluctant because of the fear, whether it be agents, managers, FA, governing bodies. I, I don't know what it is, but it causes them this this type of effect where it's, they, they want to detach themselves, they find it negative.